All right, today we're going to be reviewing the uh, 45 watt maximum output uh, thermoelectric uh, generator from uh, Tegmart. There you go. They can be bought online. I'll put a link on the uh, description. Um, first thing I want to say, I just got this box. Uh, I put it in a shopping online shopping cart for a while, and they sent me a coupon for ten uh, percent off. And I was like, okay, all right, I need one of these. It's a pricey item, but <clears throat> sometimes money doesn't matter when you need something. So anyway, so I go ahead and buy it. But on the shopping cart on the checkout, all they have is two-day priority mail shipping as an option. And that was over sixty dollars, so they gave you a seventy dollar coupon, but then they charge you uh, over sixty dollars for two day priority mail. I did not need two day priority mail, and it was the Thanksgiving break, so I didn't get it anywhere near in two days. So it was all pointless, and I'm not very happy about that. But it is a nice piece of equipment, and they're just tricky folks. So I mean, if they want to do things like that, then it's their uh, business not mine so anyway something to be aware of so I'm gonna go ahead and open this sucker it's fresh out of the uh, post, post office um, so let's get down to it um, alright so I was gonna have a nice uh, studio and stuff like that but decided to uni do university instead and I got nothing set up for that and other things so, that's why it's kind of rinky-dink. Plus, I don't got time to do this. I got to be writing reports and crap at the university. But trust me, I'm already doing this. So, bear with me. I am a slave. Because uh, I'm fascinated by this. And I guess there's all kinds of videos on YouTube about the Tegmart founder or something. It was really interesting how he was sort of age and he got really ill for weird weird things weird reasons so we'll go over what i paid here i can't see this very good through the video so this is a the sales here this is a product <laughs> this is gonna be another crappy youtube video people complain about because the dang lighting sucks so this is what I ordered. Um, yeah, I can't see this. If I can't see this, you can't see this. Let me see if I can do this right. Well, a little bit more light on here. Okay, so comes from Tagmart. Right. And this is a this is a product, right? This is their contact info, and this is what you're gonna pay, right? Oh, it was a, it was eighty dollar discount, and then the, the mandatory priority mail. So, if only it was like. You know, cheaper cost. That's two day ridiculous. Anyway, so that was the final five eleven thirty five. So anyway, let's get over that. The reason why I was awkward showing you that was because um because uh I got some personal info in there. So here's the directions. Um. So yeah, you can you can pause on this and uh, get the gist of it. Just trying to get over this video quick. I don't know when this camera will end. I got different cameras with different personalities, if you know what I mean. Um, here's the cautions. 
yeah you just pause it on on this so you can read it at your leisure because I gotta get through this otherwise the video will end and then we'll be cut off so there's three uh, there's three different um, papers in here it tells you what's going on nice color printouts so I'll have to take care of those and they have these on their online um, website too we're looking at those Okay, let's get down to the nitty gritty. So you got a foam. Well, this I can just show you out here, I guess. So you get. <laughs> this is like one of the worst videos ever shot. It's so dark. Well, it's winter time. <laughs> oh, this is not good. This lantern is not sufficient. Okay, so use this as a background. Yeah. So you get um, terminal connectors. These are these are to connect to your battery. The alligator clips, right? You got a red one right here that's moving. I don't know if you can see that. And a black one, and that ends in one of these special terminals. It's like a three-hole dealy, dealy deal. This video is going to be sucking so bad with bad lighting. So it terminates that. That probably um, that's the charger aspect. So this is obviously the charger battery. And since it terminates in that one special connector we'll show you this one. This one is to I think run a USB because it's got a USB uh, USB uh, port right there and then um, a cigarette lighter port here and that also terminates in that special connector. You kind of see it better in this one. Same connector. So what that means is you can only have one of those connected at a time. You're either going to be charging your, your 12 volt battery or you're going to be running some equipment so that's something to consider something I don't know but you know. so it's wrapped in nice thick plastic well uh, well wrapped it smells like styrofoam It looks like the bottom is like the bottom of a electric uh, ironing board iron. Serious. It's got a thick. It's a thick metal. Uh, thick metal deal. Even has some foam on that to protect it, like a, a little foam uh, paper. You can't see that anyway. I'm gonna take this outside because otherwise you cannot see any of this, and I don't want to have crap level videos on my ch channel alright so bear with me
All right. Wow, we can see everything now, can't we? Okay, so you got little handles to carry it by right here. You got these things. Not too sure what they are right now. You got the brand on there. You got um the model and serial hand done. This is that special connector I was talking about. Here's the fans, the cooling fans. The other side. The cool thing I was going to show you. Because the bottom. It's, it reminds me. Some kind of special stuff. But anyway. Are those meant to be broken? I don't know. It's kind of soft stuff. I just touched it and it, something happened. Anyway. I guess that's a coating. Anyway, I think this is a metal plate. That's got some kind of special coating on it. It appears to be kind of fragile. Um. We'll go over the connectors again. Here's the battery charging connector. Alligator clips on that end. And the special connection on that side. Charging a 12 volt battery. And here's, um, that just happened? I don't know. Here's the, uh, Cigarette lighter slash USB connector. I guess this is heat resilient cord wrapping. Um, I was wondering how long this was. So apparently it's going to be fairly long, which is good. Because the application I have needs to be long. I'll go over that later in another video, I think. So, anyway, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. I tend to try this on my uh, um, rocket stove. It's uh, a Silverfire uh, Survivor rocket stove. So we'll try that application soon. Okay, thank you very much. Subscribe and like, it helps me out. If you help me out, I can make more videos. Be altruistic. Thank you.